Hey, welcome back everyone. Tony Gullich, the Great White Capper, coming to you with NCAA football action. These games will be played on Saturday, September 24th, 2022. Let's waste no time. Get right into this first video. Clemson Tigers at the Wake Forest Demon Deacons. Uh, both teams 3-0 straight up. Uh, Clemson covered their first game against Georgia Tech, which we did have. But they failed to cover in either of their next two games, 35-12 over Furman, 48-20 against Louisiana Tech. I did note they gave up a couple cheap touchdowns in the fourth quarter against La Tech, uh, but they failed to make the number. Wake Forest, 3-0. They covered that first game by half a point against VMI, 33.5 point spread, 144-10. Then they demolished Vanderbilt, 14.5 point favorites, 45-25. And then last week, 37-36 win over Liberty. They really got trashed in the second half to Wake Forest defense. They gave up 28 points. And Liberty scored a touchdown with a minute left and went for two in an attempt to win the game but came up short. Wake Forest survived that play and they survived Liberty, 37-36. Uh, keys to this game guys you know offense appears more stable for clemson we'll just take a quick peek at clemson Their offense appears to be more stable they didn't give up the uh two garbage touchdowns to la tech but the offense managed to put up 35 points in the second half of that game which is a good sign for this team because defensively they are pretty strong guys uh, clemson d should be able to hold up wake forest Still questions about their defense. I really, the way Liberty trashed them in that second half, it really left a lot of question marks. And in the overall analysis of this game, guys, Wake Forest is, is kind of a gimmicky offense. It is tough to st uh, stop. They use a lot of misdirections. They do a delayed handoff at the mesh point where the quarterback reads. And when they do this, often they'll send tight ends straight down the field on straight patterns trying to catch those gaps. And they get a lot of good yardage plays with these gimmicky type of runs, misdirection. Everybody goes left, the play's going to the right. Uh, team like Clemson's seen this enough, though. And I think the defense of Clemson is going to be just too strong here for Wake. I don't expect them to completely shut Wake down because that's kind of a hard thing to do. But they can contain them on enough possessions defensively to where their offense can really make Wake Forest more weak defense pay. I just don't think the defense of Wake Forest will keep pace here. I think Clemson has a little too much for them. And at the end of the game, guys, Clemson minus seven is going to be the play for me. And a projected score of 35-24, Clemson over Wake Forest. Um, I think Wake Forest is a decent team, but they're going to have a little too much to prove here. Last year, similar situation. Wake Forest did put up 27 points, but they still got throttled 48-27. I think a similar type of game is what you can expect here, especially now that I believe that Clemson's offense has started to find a little bit of groove, and uh, perhaps this could be a big statement game for them. We will find out. But for this video, guys, Clemson minus 7 over Wake Forest. I want to thank everybody for tuning in to the video. If you like the content, guys, please give me a thumbs up. It will help me a lot. Uh, be sure to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell will alert you immediately when all new videos are posted. Best of luck to everyone with all of your action, guys, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.